Hey there, what is up guys? I gotta make this short video here. You know, on this YouTube channel, I don't get that many trolls. But, uh, I sure attracted some this week, it looks like. I just got done deleting about a dozen, uh, comments from my inbox. I didn't think to, uh, record this until just now when I just started realizing this guy's just a troll. But this guy's posting a bunch of comments under this Larry O'Connor name, and then under this, and then he keeps replying to himself with this Bill Smith name. And if you look up, uh, of course, see, it's just a troll account. Videos, none. About, <laughs> made it May 29th, just, uh, two days ago. <laughs> And then the other account must be his main one. It's been open for a couple months. Of course, no videos. It's like he's subscribed to some of the same people that uh, I uh, am subscribed to. Probably just went through my subs and started uh, subscribing to him to be a troll to look for me. I don't know what his deal is. He's probably one of those sprinkler installers or maybe some other hack installer just kind of got upset. You know, and so he's making all these stupid comments, but I just delete some of those. But I thought at first maybe this, you know, Bill guy was a was actually a carrier uh, technician engineer that he claimed to be. Here's one of the videos that these guys are trolling. This is the one last year where I, uh, and it was before December when I changed them. It was still hot when I did this, but this unit was came with the high static fan option, and they were loud. <laughs> You cannot hear. Now, you had to use earplugs to stand next to them. And the thing is, this is an option. This is not the standard option. This is a high static fan option. It was. It's something that's ordered, you know, with the unit special order. So we don't know what the deal is because it was not needed in this area to have the high static fan option. So either somebody ordered those fans without knowing what they're doing or they someone got a deal on a, a unit that was already built, you know, equipped with it. Maybe they wanted it quick and they had it, you know, and so they bought it like that but wasn't needed like that um so right here you can see the before and after for the loud and now with the standard fan option which is what it would come with if you didn't order the option see it's quiet can't even hear it running when you're standing you know 30 feet away before it was screaming loud in the whole parking lot it was insane. Well, these guys are slandering me, saying that, oh, it's not going to make it through the summer. The head pressure is going to be high and stuff like that. Well, because of this video, I, I now know that the, the guy is just a troll, and he was lying in his other clips that he was a carrier engineer. Because it was Carrier who first looked at this unit um, when we took over this building. They pretty much went through it before we took over the maintenance, you know, HVAC and everything on this building, on this unit. And they're the ones that brought it up that that fan option, the high static fan option, was not needed. And they have several motors and blades were worn. And they said, you know, if we went to the standard ones, they're quieter. So we researched it very well. Carrier pretty much, you know, in correspondence said that it would be the standard option was all we needed and that it would be, that was recommended. And that is what we did. I actually saved a lot of money. I put six brand new motors, fan blades on there. And uh, because it needed, you know, several motors were worn in there already, and they were very expensive anyway. So for the price of just a couple motors and these fan blades, I put on six brand new motors and blades, standard. And it's the system's been running great. I fixed a lot of things on this. This thing was quite run down when we took it over. I fixed a couple things on there, and it this, this sucker runs like a champ. I actually like this unit. So, anyway, I don't want to go too long on this, but these guys are just trolls. He went to another one of the videos. Keep saying a retard with an EPA card. <laughs> As this guy uh, has no uh, videos or nothing, he's just a troll. Oh, let's see. He said something about my... Buy Look at this. This this guy's a retard. <laughs> Call me a retard? Buy degreaser, moron. My apprentices all use it instead of coil cleaner. Coil cleaner will etch aluminum. Whatever, dude, when you rinse it off, it doesn't hurt it. I've been using it on my rims, on my cars, for over 10 years. And if it hasn't defaced the rims on my SUV and on my other cars, it's not going to hurt this. Okay? This guy is obviously a troll. He probably, does, probably doesn't even work for Carrier. He's probably a sprinkler line installer or somebody. The other ones seem to be upset with me on, on this YouTube channel. But I don't know. Who knows? 
I don't know what his problem is. It's he doesn't have a problem with with these videos. I think he's just picking to troll them. I think he has a problem with something else. Maybe he's a Goodman dealer. I don't know. So <laughs> I just want to have a little laugh on this before I delete these and just uh, have you guys check it out. 